Thanks for being here. I'm John Erickson with your NBC26 News Update. The latest now in an Amber Alert issued out of the Milwaukee area over the weekend. Police, family and friends are still looking for three-year-old Major Harris. Authorities have, though, found the SUV at the center of it all. Police loaded it onto a truck to check it for evidence. The suspect in the Amber Alert has been found dead of an apparent self-inflicted gunshot wound, but there is still no sign of three-year-old Major. Don't lose hope and, you know, keep them in your best spirits. And I mean, I'm praying for you. And I'm pretty sure everyone's praying for you. Major's mother was found dead last week. Police believe that is when the boy whom you see right here was taken. And Wisconsin has seen a spike in Amber Alerts this year. The state has had a system in place for the last 18 years, and 20% of all of the alerts have come in 2021. The Department of Justice for Wisconsin has not been able to pinpoint a specific reason behind this trend. We have had 53 activations since 2003, since the program started. This year in 2021, we have had 11 activations so far. Uh, that is a, a great increase to the previous years. All 10 previous alerts this year resulted in the child being found safe. Let's turn to a check of our weather now with Chief Meteorologist Cameron Moreland. Cameron? John, another absolutely beautiful day across northeast Wisconsin. Skies are mostly sunny and temperatures are now in the lower to mid 70s, but there is much cooler weather off to our north and west that will be moving in for the second half of the week behind a strong system that's going to bring us gusty winds and some showers and thunderstorms for Wednesday. High temperatures in the upper 50s to lower 60s, but then falling during the afternoon with gusty northeast winds. For your latest news, sports and weather, download the NBC 26 News app. It's free. Have a great day.